There's something very nice here. It's the wind car. Look. Incredibly, the wind car is with us. Hmm. Which actually I didn't think was going to happen. And I've actually got a moment with Jim as well, who is one of the, well, you're the head of engineering at Ecotricity, so you have a fair bit of involvement in making this thing work, I guess. Sure, yeah. So tell me a little bit about your involvement with the car and, and how it's going, really. Well, it's going very well. It's nearly complete. Yeah. And uh, we started it a couple of years ago, and it's done quite a bit of testing, and it's running fine. Phenomenal performance. Yeah. Are you getting to drive it regularly? Uh, we do on the testing at airfields and things, but we yeah. don't use it on the road. Where have your biggest challenges been, do you think, in getting it, in getting it going? The battery management system, for sure. Yeah. Controlling the lithium cobalt cell. Did you, did you at any point think lithium's the wrong way to go? You know, maybe no. we should look at another technology? No, that's, that's got the power density. Yeah. So that's by far still the best way for a performance vehicle like this. Yeah. What's the handling like on it? Is it Very good. Is it, is, it, is it kind of similar to driving an Elise or something like that or not? Yeah, it is. It's um, possibly at gross vehicle weight slightly better. Yeah. Because the weight distribution is nearly 2% better towards the front. And what's its 0 to 60 now, do we think? 4.4. Yeah, continuous torque, yeah. all the way up. The 100, 0 to 100 is impressive, 9.4, 9.4. And what kind of charging time are we looking at now? Then? Trickle charge is 8 to 10 hours. Fast charge, little unknown, because we haven't got the fast charger yet, but probably three hours, I would guess. Jim, thanks. I really right. appreciate your time. No problem.